Because you know I'm all about that bass, about that bass, no trouble. I'm all Hi you guys, I'm here with an original video and I'll be making this fishtail with a single chain border bracelet. And I don't think it's as hard to make, so I think it's like a really good bracelet to start with. So, the, bra the bands I have is black, glittery orange, and glittery blue, and I have a metal tipped hook with me. Also, I have the rain balloon that I'm making this bracelet with. You could use any loom you want, except you'll be it will be a growing bracelet, so if you're using like any other loom than a rainbow loom, you'll be needing to pull it out from the side. So let's get started. You're gonna start with your middle color, with, or your first middle color, and I'll be using blue. I'm gonna twist it on this top two pins on your loom. And it doesn't really matter on like the t any two pins, except you need it to be going up, like the up and down pins. <laughs> so now using um, a, your second middle color, if it's going to be the same, then use the same, but I'm going to be using glittery orange, and I'm going to put that down regularly. The first one was twisted, but the second one's not. Then I'm going to add our last um, middle band going on the same two pins and straight, not the same. Now we're going to start with the single chain border, which is the outside bands. I'm using the black. And you're going to twist it on at the outside two pins. So you don't want it to be up and down pins. You want it the longer way. So then you're gonna, that's twisted, you're gonna make the next one straight across. And then you're gonna take your hook, you're gonna pull this bottom one over, and this bottom one over, and then you're gonna take this bottom one over, and the second bottom one over. On each of the four pins, you're gonna grab the twisted bands up and over the pin. Next, you're gonna take your next um, middle band color. I'm gonna put it along the <laughs> the up and down way, and you're gonna place your outside color the long way. And once again, you're gonna pull the bottom band on each pin. You're just gonna grab the the one bottom one on each pin, pin and pull it. Over. Make sure you're grabbing the right band each time when you're pulling it over. But you're gonna repeat that the whole way. So put on your next one. Expands. If you want to have different colors, like rainbow colors in the middle, make sure you keep track on which band you're putting on next, because it uh, starts to get harder once you get to, um, once your bracelet's starting to grow down your loom, or out your loom, so I'm gonna do this two more times, and then I'll do it, like, off the camera, so. Then grab your next band and for the middle and put that on long ways. And pull the bottom band over on each of the four pins. And if you if you're getting um if yours is you, if yours is starting to squish, like on my, like mine, like onto the, the pin bar, um, you could go ahead and pull it out now. I think I like to keep mine squished until it gets a little bit longer, longer, or like these bands start to get up towards the pin. I think it's a lot easier to do to do it on and on because I think it looks a lot better if you don't pull it early. So I'm gonna do this one more time. 
You're gonna put in the fish tail band and then your single chain band. So now I'll be doing the rest on, off camera, and I'll see you guys when I'm done with my bracelet. Alright, so I'm almost done with my bracelet. Let's see what it looks like so far. So now I'm just going to keep on going for a little bit more. So right now, let's see how far it's been. I think that's actually done. So this is how you take it off. It's not it's not so hard to take it off, but first you're gonna um, you have to end off with your with one band across two pins, and you have to um, be left with two bands or yeah two bands on each of these up and down pins. So you should have one here and one here, two here and two here, all right? So you're gonna pull over the bottom band on the fishtail band, or yeah, the middle bands. So you're gonna pull over the middle, one, the bottom ones, and then you're gonna grab one side of the single chain bands. It, it doesn't really matter which band you pick from each pin, but you just have to make sure you bring it back to the same pin. Just like that, and you do the same thing to the fishtail bands. Right. Next, you're gonna take your two C-clips. You need two C-clips here. Um, and it doesn't really matter what clips you have, but I think C-clips work as best. That's why you should have also you should also have two cat bands at the end. So you're gonna take your this first link or this first band, um, which is a single chain one, and you're gonna put it onto your hook, and then you're gonna clip it on. That's clipped, and you can let it go off your hook. That's how it looks. And you do the same thing with your other C-clip. And you do that to this other one that you have to put this on to your hook. Now you can finally take it off, off your whole loom. And um, you could attach on your last C-clip on to the ones that are on your hook. So I clip that on. This is my whole bracelet. It's a real nice bracelet, so I wish you guys enjoyed this. Next, you're gonna take your the fishtail capped band, which is your middle band, your middle color band. I'm gonna take the fishtail um, C clip. I'm gonna attach it on. To your cat, your, your fishtail cat band. So finally, you're gonna do your single chain cat band to end this off. If I could kind of fish for it here, I can't really find it. Oh, this is it right here. I'm gonna fish for that and put the clip that on. I'm not sure if I went all ca off camera, so <laughs> sorry about that if I did. But I am finally done with my whole bracelet. Um, 
It's a really pretty bracelet if yours did not turn out like mine. Sorry if the instruction, maybe I went too fast. Maybe you can't see it so much. That's how it looks on my wrist. I wish you guys enjoyed how to make this bracelet. If it did work for you, please comment it down below. And also I want to say that a reminder is that I post videos every Wednesday and Friday. So please subscribe and yeah, see you guys in my next video. Bye.